right, guys. So, um, here I am. Black shot. Christmas has been. It's New Year's almost now. So I thought that I would come back and see what's been going on inside the game. Um, I want to make it very clear that I do not expect to come back permanently inside Black Shot. <clears throat> I just want to look at this web shop here, uh, pop inside the game, maybe test a couple things out, look around the place and see what's going on inside the game. Um, interesting to see them selling items on the web shop again. A couple of things that I want to highlight, which I think you guys will know I'm going to mention. Cupid Halo costs BSC. Halo Wings costs BSC. Yeah. Not really going to have much, uh, much positivity in these items being BSC. I don't think it's good. I think it's pretty fucked up. Um, you know, we'll go inside the game, we'll see what's going on. Um, I will test out the new BP weapon. Uh, we'll see how it is, basically. So let's pop into the game. Uh, so I am in the game. Um, I'm going to have a little look around the shop. Have a little look around the gold box and tell you what I think about the situation. Um, the shop really doesn't seem to have changed. <clears throat> Sorry about that guys. Um, the shop doesn't seem to have changed really. I mean, it's got the usual same items. Yeah. Um, from my understanding, they did finally start selling the AK Red Dragon on the web store. But I think it was a limited, uh, f a limited edition. You can only get so many because I didn't see it when I looked at the store just then. Um, everything looks the same here. Again, snipers, pretty much the same. You guys can tell me in the comment section if I'm missing stuff out here. I don't think I am, but you know, you can tell me. Nice to see the candy cane is BP, because it's a fun weapon. Um, everything else is as usual. Um, yeah. Throwing, uh, throwing knife is the jingle bauble. Christmas bauble is BP, very good. Not happy that the Halo wings and the um, uh, the Halo and the wings are BSC, but at least this is BP for people who are interested. Still don't know why this is BSC. It's a fucking joke, but whatever. Your reindeer stuff, uh, usual bits and bobs. Yeah, if you get that if you're interested. I think I've got mine. Uh, Santa's beard, um, yeah. Not really much else I need to talk about. Now we can go into the Happy New Year packs. We have uh, the pack A, which contains the AK-47 Snow, the P90 Azrael, additional BP, the Tactical Package 1, which is good because that's the one you need, and 20,000 BP. Um... As far as value for 15 euros approximately for this package, I would have to say that it's okay. It's not bad. I wish that they would have taken out the additional BP and put in a medkit premium, but maybe that package might be too good then. Um, what I will say is I do think it's not bad. If you're a rifle person, uh, if you're an SMG person, I think both of those guns are fine. They're adequate. They do the good job. That's that. We go to B, this is where they usually add a load of shit, and they pretty much have. AK-47 Snow, again, fine. Uzi Blue is meh, it's okay. Taurus Judge, not bad, it's okay. Flash Frag, that is a BP item for mastery. Pardon me. Tactical Pack, again, is fine. Tactical Pack 2, it, I just don't see the point. Additional Experience is fine, and the BP... Is fine. 22 euros. I mean, it's okay. The value is okay, but most of the stuff in there you're probably not really going to be interested in. I mean, like the tactical package too, you probably don't really give a fuck about it. The Uzi Blue, you probably don't give a fuck about it. So, I mean, it, it's okay, but that's about it. it it's okay. 
the big boy package. Now this package contains the HK416 Snow, pretty damn good. AWP Candy, which is very good. The Uzi Blue, meh. Taurus Judge, again, it's just a pistol, eh, it's okay. Flash Frag, BP, Mastery BP. Tactical Package 1, Tactical Package 2. Mastery Bonus is nice, and the BP is, is whatever, it's fine. HK416 Snow is a decent rifle. It's not bad at all. It's pretty good. Um, you know, I don't know. I mean, for the price, guys, it's, again, you know, for €26, Euros, I can't really say that it's bad value. But what I will say is, you know, it's like going into a shop and buying five pairs of socks and you're going to use one or two of them and the other ones you don't like. Even if that is good value, you're still wasting those other three socks because you're not using them. And this is the same situation. You're going to have the Uzi Blue that's not going to do anything. You're going to have Tactical Package 2 that's pretty much not going to do anything. So you're going to have dud items. What I will say is that if you are a player who runs multi-weapon, you will appreciate the HK416 Snow and the AWP combination because that'll be pretty strong. Um, and for, like I said, for 26 euros, I don't really think you can complain too much. Again, as I mentioned in the first box, would like to see Medkit Premium. But hey, we can't get everything in a pack, can we? Um, other packages, I don't really... I, I find this quite sad the way these items get put into BSC packages. I do find this quite sad. This one is a lot better. Um, you know, this one's sort of fine if you want it. I think it's pretty expensive, but it's okay. I mean, look at this. I'm getting the Santa whole Santa set, and I'm paying 1,600 BSC. Um... Why would I not just buy this? Um, you know, why would I not just buy this? You get so much in this. Again, I will say, you know, some of it is a little bit useless, but I, this package to me is just the gold. This this is gold, this package. This is like gold tier. Um, similar to the Steam package, which again is pretty much gold tier. Full packages, very good, you know. Anyway. Let's move on to the gold box. So inside the gold box we have a very strange gold box. The gold box A. I, I just think it's strange because of the fact that it is um it has the the golden snipe the golden shotgun, I should say. Very strange that they have the M3 the Golden Super 90. Don't know why they're doing this. To me, this screams out of Asia treatment and I want to preface that by saying that I'm not trying to be funny about the Asia server I like the guys on Asia, but what I will say is the fact that you can use cash to buy mastery items Is something that this seems to be doing here Again, I could be mistaken You tell me in the comments if I am mistaken um, Now the gold box B has the M24 Siberian. This is pretty damn good um, I think the M24 All-Star is probably just as good as this one, but again, this is good. One thing that I will mention, because it's a little bit more hidden, is the fact that the HK416N is back inside the game. Everyone knows this game is, th this rifle is very strong. It's pretty much the top of the line rifle in Asia, if I'm not mistaken. It come with the Nina package. So, yeah. Gold box premium, as expected, if you're going to pay the top dollar, you're going to get rain. I don't need to say anything about rain anymore. We know what's going on with rain. Yeah. Now, AWP Spectre, I like it. It's not To me, it's not the best sniper. To me, I would actually go with the AWP Candy, which is in this box. But the Spectre is good. It is good looks very nice as well which helps now um 999 days fantastic giving people the chance to earn an item i mean very small chance 
but giving people the chance to earn the items for three years is, is good. That's the way they do it in Asia, it's the way they should do it on here. Auto 9 Christmas is OP, or the Auto 9 Xmas. Uzi Graffiti, I haven't personally tested this. If it's similar to the Uzi Jaguar, it probably is pretty damn good. The Christmas Sock. I don't know about the Christmas Sock. I think, if I'm not mistaken, that's the grenade that, that poisons that I showed a long time ago that the GMs were using. Again, if you guys know more than me, please bang it in the comments and tell me what the Christmas sock is. I don't have the item, I can't tell you right now. Um, now I'm going to hop into a custom match and test this Banff Edge. Interesting name, uh, Banff Edge. And let me see uh, how it is. Creator room. Snowball fight sounds quite interesting. Weapon race. Uh, throw a knife. I'm just gonna go in the TDM or something, guys. Let's uh, hop into. Let's hop into the school. I haven't been in the school. Uh, so let's hop in here and see what's going on. Now remember, please. I do not have tactical package one. That means I do not have advanced dominator. I'm going to give you my sort of feelings on the weapon. This is not law. This is just how I believe, you know, the weapon. What I will say is they've used some very similar model aspects to another gun in the game. You guys will remember what that gun is because it's the uh, LWRC. If you look closely, it looks very similar to the LWRC. Now, one thing to note, it has a scope. I like that it has a scope. It has a nice scope as well. The scope looks nice on the gun. The gun itself looks pretty good. I gotta say, it does look pretty nice. Um, let's see how it fires. Now, um, I want to just... I do apologize, guys. Like I said, I haven't... Um, I haven't been on this game... Uh, you know, I just fresh installed this just to try and see what's going on for you guys. So let's go here. Again, sorry guys to... Uh, sorry to do that. So let's test this out, okay? So let's give it a tap fire. Now please understand I don't have the tactical package one like I said. Um I may well purchase that and start playing a little bit. We will see. Um, what I will say is that it is a retextured LWRC. It seems to perform similar to the LWRC. It seems to, well, it looks similar. You know it has a very similar animation with the reload. So it's fine. It's fine. For BP, I cannot complain. There's nothing I can say to complain about this weapon. It is a nice weapon. It is a modern looking weapon, you know, I don't really think anyone can complain. So yeah. That's it guys. So let me just uh, come out of here now and I'm going to be able to test the... Uh... I'm going to be able to test the... AK-47 Red Dragon, this guy has it. Alright, so he's given me this weapon to try out. Um, let's just give it a test. Okay. Please remember I don't have advanced dominator.
There we go. There we go, guys. That's about it. So, um, thank you for watching. I hope that you had a nice Christmas and a nice New Year. I may try to, um, I may try to get back into playing. We will see. Uh, but this weapon seems damn strong. What can I say? Having it as limited just means that you've given some people who were willing to cash straight away the option to buy power. Yeah, never mind. Thanks for watching, guys. Oh, 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 oh,